So in this video, I'm going to show you the easiest way you can make millions of coins in your mobile. So make sure to like and subscribe if you're excited for it. Right now, we all need a lot of coins, of course, to go out and do a lot of these exchanges right there, founder exchanges, get ourselves club points, get some players from the market and put them into club points. So then we will be able to open these packs right there. And in this video, as I said, I'm going to show you a very, very easy way you can go out and make that happen. First of all, in the exchanges chapter, if we go into foundation, we've got these untradeable coin exchanges. This is not the main, main part of this video, but I'm going to talk about that as well, because you can make some coins from there as well. So we've got this 110 overall exchange right there. As you can see that you can do 10 times that expires in 10 hours. It's going to it's gonna appear after 10 hours today as well. And we've got uh, 106 to 109 overalls as well as 10, uh, 102 to 105 overalls. And you can go ahead and make coins from them. You probably got a lot of untradeable cards in your team right now with opening old packs, new opening some founder packs right now as well. So you can go ahead and put in those 110 overall cards into this and get a lot of coins. For example, I'm going to put in uh, this not 110 overall oils about minimum amount that you are going to get is 5 million coins. So you're not losing anything. You're just putting in untradeable cards and you're getting some coins for it, which which is very, very good, of course. And you've got nowhere else to use those uh, 110 overall cards other way. In Founder 17 Club, for club points, the minimum amount that you can use, the minimum rating is 111 overall. So that's a very, very nice exchange, at least in my opinion. I'm gonna go ahead and do a few of these first and see how much coins I get, but then I'm gonna get into the main part of this video. These are just if you've got some untradeable cards. As you can see there as well, I need some coins. I definitely need some coins. I've got 24 million coins right now after open, after getting a couple of days. So definitely need some coins. You can obviously get more than 5 million coins, but 5 million, 5 million is the minimum amount. I just want to see me get more than 5 mil at least once. So let's go ahead and open a couple more of these and see if I'm going to get that. I will be able to do all 10 of these, but I've got two of my players uh, on in one of my lineup. So I have to take them out first. Uh, I'm going to put in Al Jabba right there as well. But yeah, we are not getting lucky. It's not, you You don't have a high chance to get more than the minimum amount from these exchanges, but even that minimum amount will give you some decent amount of coins. There is Ian Wright right there, and I'm going to put in Litman in as well. And I'm not going to do the last one right now. I'm going to do it later on. Uh, five mil, because it's going to take a little bit longer to take uh, one of those players out of my team right now. There we go. Are going to, oh, there we go then. 12 million coins instead of five mil. From our last one, we've got 12 million coins. That's 7 million coins extra. I've just made like 50 mil, right? I, I, I'm pretty sure I had less than 10 million coins. I just made 50 mil from just doing that. There is 106 to 109 one, of course. I'm not gonna do it right now. I'm gonna do it off camera, but you can get up to 9.4 million coins that way as well. Minimum amount is 800K. And you go 102 to 105 overall as well, where you can do a lot of these untradeable ones. But the main part of this video is about the tradables. And in this 110 overall exchange right there, you need to put in tradable 110 overall card and you will be able to get from 11 million coins to 22 million coins. And this is a guaranteed profit for you. If you don't have any untradable cards, you can do those untradable exchanges, of course. But you can, everybody can do this exchange right there. All you need is tradable cards and you can buy any, not any, but most of these 110 overall cards for uh, for less than 10 million coins. As you can see right there, I bought 12 cards uh, for 10 mil or lower and I'm 100% guaranteed to make profit with this because I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to get at least 11 million coins from, uh, from those exchanges. So that's the easiest way you can make coins right now. 1 million coin profit is guaranteed from every single one of these pa uh, pa packs but you might get even more profit if you get lucky. For example, I got 12 million coins instead of five mil from the untradable one, of course. So I'm gonna do it 10 times as well. And I'm gonna see if I'm gonna get lucky at least once. Not only this one, but we've got the 106 to 109 overall exchanges right there. If you if you can't sell any of your players uh, for like 1.8 1, 1 mil or more, you can do this exchange as well. I've got a lot of these tradable cards as well. I'm gonna try to get as much coins as possible gonna do all of these exchanges some of them off camera of course i'm gonna do this one 10 overall on camera right now and uh, the other ones off camera and get as much coins as possible because i do want to get a lot of club points so then all able to, to then be able to open some exchange packs there so we are gonna put in a costa right there we've got 11 million coins still so no no luck from this one i'll take it though i'll take it i'm still getting 1 million coin profit there we go that's uh, that's 5 point no 6.5 million coin profit instead of 1 mil we got 16.5 million coins from that one, as easy as that. 11 mil again, still a profit, 
but you got a chance to make even more profit. So that's nice. 11 million coins again. This is gonna be second to last one. We're gonna put in Parisi right there. And this is gonna be the last one again. We're gonna put in the Italian lot back. We did not get more than 11 mil, but at least we got um, 16.5 mil once. And we got 12.5 uh, 12 million coins, I, I think it was, from the Uncredible one in a world card as well. So that was quite decent, that was quite decent. I'm gonna do a couple of these as well to see if I can get anything decent. I don't know, some of these cards might be worth more than like two mil, for example. So it's probably not the best idea for me to put uh, some of these cards in. This card is definitely not worth a lot, Camara. I packed a lot of these cards uh, from those uh, from those packs. We've got, I'm gonna put in another Camara right there and see if I can get more than 1.8 mil at least once. I'm hoping to get it, I'm hoping to get it. Let's go ahead and put X there as well, the CDM from Germany. Uh, we've got Jovetic, we've got a lot of cards that you can uh, that I can put in, for example. If you've still got a lot of card a lot of these cards left, make sure to check the uh, check them in the market if some of these 106 to 109 overall cards are worth more than more than this exchange in the market if you if they if they're not and if you just can't sell them if there are a lot of cards on the market, you can go on and do these exchanges as well. The same thing that I'm doing right here. I'm gonna be able to do it three more times. Um, I, I'm pretty sure Guara and Emery Chan are worth a little bit more. Emery Chan, I'm not sure actually. So let's go ahead and put him in 1.8 mil again. I'm going. I'm not gonna put in Lafon because he lo he's like five million coins. I'm sure Saint Just is not worth that much really. So gonna put Saint Just there as well. Still 1.8 mil. Oh, I can do this uh, 30 times actually. This is gonna be the last one for this video though. I'm gonna do this one as well. Put in. Um, I'm gonna put in Campbell there and we go 1.8 mil there again. So no luck from this one, but still not a bad one, I think. At least in my opinion, it's not a bad one. And we got the untradable one as well for 106 to 109 overall. Here, as you can see, you can do as many of these as you want because they are untradable. You can't really get them, uh, you, you can't really sell them and you don't need to use them on anything else. The game is ending you might as well just use them in these exchanges right there. And you probably have a lot of 106 to 109 overall untradeable cards and some 110 overall untradeable cards. You can go on and get a lot of coins this way. I'm not getting more than the minimum amount right there as well, which is a little bit annoying, but it's okay. I'm still making profit, right? Um, I've almost got 100, uh, 200 mil. I'm gonna go until I've got 200 mil and then end this video right there. Give me more than 800k, please, nope. And this is gonna be the one that's gonna take me up to 200 mil. Nope. Uh, I mean, it did take me up to 200 mil, but uh, I didn't get more than the minimum amount. Let me go ahead and take out one of those 110 overall cards, actually. There is Rudiger right there. Who was the other one? I'm gonna take out Rudiger as well. Uh, I'm gonna put in uh, Saliba, of course. That's that's gonna be enough for, uh, for this one. Uh, let's go into Foundation and let's open one last 110 overall player pack. From the last one, well, I, I guess he's still in one of my other lineups then, right? Um, where is he then? Where is he? He's not he, He's not there, he is there. Right, let's go ahead and take him out then. Uh, let's put in a Saliba card once again, and then we're gonna do that exchange. You see in there as well? Uh, he's not, but Hinkapi. So let me go ahead and take out Hinkapi as well, put in the Lake right there, and I'm gonna do one last exchange uh, for one thing overall untradeable card and let's see if you can get lucky i'm gonna put him up here actually if you can get lucky and get more than five million coins again nope but that's still all right that's gonna be the end of the video guys for today then make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it and peace